Hello, my name is Ahmad. If you see my elephant Pooja, yell Pooja. Pooja! At the beginning of the proceedings, a member of the House of Commons is taken hostage by the Crown. This is to ensure the Queen's safety as she enters a potentially hostile Parliament. Under safe return of the Queen, the hostage is released. Gunpowder plot of 1605 involved a failed attempt by English Catholics to blow up the House of Parliament and kill the Protestant, King James I. Since that year, the cellars have been searched in order to prevent a modern-day gunpowder plot. The journey begins at the Queen's residence, Buckingham Palace. The Queen is taken in a horse-drawn carriage, and a highly trained and well-equipped cavalry rides alongside her. Hello, I'm the Queen. I'm the head of state, but I don't really do much. I'm just a pretty face. I love Buckingham Palace, and during the state opening ceremonies, I give my annual Queen's speech. Hello, I'm the Duke of Edinburgh. I enjoy intimate relations with the Queen, or what Americans call the nasty. Good day. I'm the leader of the Queen's cavalry. With my team of horsemen, we guide the Queen from Buckingham Palace to Parliament. The procession proceeds down the mall, a very long straight road adjacent to the luscious St. James Park. At the culminating point of the mall, the procession takes a right and heads down the Horse Guards Road. Now left and under the Horse Guards Arch, notice the guards near the park fence. Obviously, security is very high, and these guards, despite wearing very traditional wear, are armed with the finest in modern weaponry. After passing under the arch, the procession takes its final turn and heads down the home stretch. Crowds flock to the streets to watch this magnificent procession. They can just glimpse the Queen with her husband, the Duke of Edinburgh, through the carriage window. Pizza, 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 na 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 na. Pizza, 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 mozzarella, 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 meatballs, 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 mozzarella, 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 pizza, 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 pizza. Subsequent to the Queen's arrival to the House of Parliament, she exits her carriage and she heads to the robing room. This is the robing room. Here the Queen puts on the robes of state and the imperial state crown. After leaving the robing room, she heads to the House of Lords. My lords, pray be seated. The Queen motions to the Lord Great Chamberlain to summon the House of Commons. 
the long great Chamberlain raises his wand of office to signal me, the gentleman usher of the Black Rod. Then I turn and approach the doors of the Chamber of the Commons. The doors are slammed in my face, symbolizing the independence of the Commons and its rights to debate without the presence of the Queen. I then strike three times on the Black Rod, and then they admit me. Here I go to the door. Hey, how's it going? Gonna slam it in my face, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. So happy I'm gonna go get the Black Rod. Here I go. This is so much fun. I got it. Three times. One, two, three. I then enter and say to the Speaker of the House, Mr. Speaker, the Queen commands this Honourable House to attend Her Majesty immediately in the House of Peers. Then, the Members of Parliament follow me and the Sergeant at Arms, or the guy carrying the mace, back to the House of Lords. The Members of Parliament walk down the hall in pairs, opponents next to each other. They talk and laugh jovially because they want to present a unified Parliament to viewers. <laughs> <laughs> My lords and members of the House of Commons and my government will take forward policies to respond to the rising aspirations of the people of the United Kingdom, to ensure security for all, and to entrust more power to the Parliament and the people. Here we see the two benches of the House of Commons. Two red lines run in front of each bench in the House of Commons. These are separated by two sword lengths, so that if two members of Parliament hypothetically drew swords on each other, they would be unable to duel. Here we see the Prime Minister, Currently Gordon Brown of the Labour Party, the leader of the party in power, and behind him, the government. Here we see the leader of the opposition, currently David Cameron of the Conservative Party. Behind him is the loyal opposition. Hello, I'm the Speaker of the House. I call on people during question time. I sit in a large red seat called a wool sack. Most of the time, the members of Parliament completely ignore me. Yeah, with the pooper scoopers, we uh, follow the horses, pick up their droppings. It's a pretty tough job. Uh, we've got a lot of tools. Uh, we, we don't get paid a lot, but we've got the most important job.